Hi, my name is Amanda Jane Elliott, E double L I O double T, teach at Lincoln High, and I'm the parent of children in Grant, Bowman, and Creston. I sat here three years ago and implored you to reconsider the ill conceived notion of a six of eight schedule. At the time, I did not come close to guessing just how devastating the implications of that decision were going to be. School board, you are disingenuous when you claim the offer of a task force to work into wor look into workload issues should satisfy us. You told us during the last contract negotiations the six of eight would be decided building by building. We would have input. Just a few weeks after that contract <coughs> was signed, you imposed unilaterally. It was a monetary decision and it harms students. This is not surprising as you make decisions with no collaboration and no understanding of the impact of these ill-informed decisions will have in classrooms. At Lincoln, a six of eight schedule has had dramatic implications on my working conditions and my students' learning conditions. We are at 147% capacity, a crippling condition exacerbated by the need to offer eight periods. It means no teacher is in their classroom without a class being taught. Think about that. Three teachers now share my classroom. There is not an empty room in Lincoln to grade, to communicate with parents, to meet with students, to simply be for a minute. It is impossible to put up student work or to make a welcoming learning environment as we churn students in and out. We have hundreds of students with gaps in their schedule in a building where the cafeteria is being carved into classrooms and support staff slashed. Students have nowhere to go. They are forced to leave the building and many of them don't bother coming back. Our truancy rate has skyrocketed. My own sophomore daughter has a six period <coughs> schedule and I have no way of knowing where she is in those empty hours. You should be ashamed of the cavalier attitude you have towards the welfare of our young people. My students lost three weeks of their school year with me when you imposed six of eight. They lost an entire short story unit and an entire film unit in my senior year. To claim giving an extra four minutes a period would give them that curriculum back is beyond insulting and speaks to the complete lack of understanding of the classroom experience and you are clearly ignorant of what the hardworking, dedicated and inspirational colleagues I work with do day in, day out on your behalf. I started this year with 184 students. If I were to give them five minutes a week, one-on-one, -on -one, that would add up to 15 hours a week. If you don't find that horrifying, I would like to know why. I hate students are getting ignored in my class and not getting the help they need. Your soul-destroying decisions have made my job impossible. When I assign an essay and spend just 10 minutes grading and offering feedback <coughs> on each one, it takes 30 hours. You cut my prep time and give me more students, yet claim it will support student learning. What would support student learning? A return to the five of seven solves the workload issue as well as the lawsuit you are facing. It is sound educational practice. Your contract proposal means I will un unable to provide a good working conditions because it is not humanly possible. You may think this fight is about money as that is what drives your decision, but you are mistaken if you think Thank you, any Ms. of Elliot. us are preparing to strike because we want more money. We are fighting for the schools Portland students deserve. Thank you.